Why does enclomiphene lower IGF-1? First of all, does it even lower IGF-1? For the average person, yes, and I will explain why, but it might not for you. So enclomiphene reliably blocks estrogen in the brain, but in other tissues, it's less predictable. Most people, for example, they get drier on enclomiphene. This indicates that enclomiphene blocks some estrogen in the kidneys, but rarely people are more watery on enclomiphene. So this indicates that within their specific physiology, enclomiphene may actually be mimicking estrogen in the kidneys. Enclomiphene, it's a serum. It can block estrogen or mimic estrogen in different tissues. Now in the liver, estrogen sensitizes the growth hormone receptor. So the more estrogenic activity, the more IGF-1 is stimulated by the hepatic growth hormone. So for most people, it appears enclomiphene blocks some estrogen in the liver, less hepatic estrogen, less IGF-1, but in some rare cases, enclomiphene could have a negligible effect or even mimic estrogen in the liver, which of course would elicit the opposite effect. That's how variable the effects of these compounds can be, which is why I always encourage testing these biomarkers for yourself if you want a definitive conclusion. And for all your supplement needs, check out the free Natty Plus Chi Chi. It is in the description below.